Okay, today we're going to make a short video of the hitch helper. We've got a hook to a new Jeep. Since a lot of our motorhome customers have a Jeep that they pull behind their coach and then want to take a Harley also, this is the answer. Now you can use the hitch helper either behind the tow vehicle or behind the motorhome and in front of the tow vehicle. I like it behind the tow vehicle like this because whenever you pull into a campground with your motorhome and it's time to unhook, you just unhook the car, park the car with the bike and hitch helper together and you can pet back right in a campsite. If you've got a bigger coach, 45 footer with this extra five feet, it, it might stick you out of a campsite or you're gonna have to uh, back off the end of the pad. So this is the way I do it, but either way works fine. Uh, you can see with the mesh here, um, it's all two by two steel, fully welded. All of our seams are double welded. And then uh, we've got a two by 10 inch steel C-channel center cross member. And then you can see all the bracing down below. Um, if you look at the quality of our welding, um, it's really second to none. This is all um, hydro cut and laser cut steel. So there are no sharp edges. It's rounded corners on everything. It has an integrated winch here. So we're gonna go ahead and lower the ramp down. Push the button, the winch releases the ramp. When the ramp gets to the ground, simply kick it out and then finish lowering it. And then you're ready to load your bike. That's all there is to it.